welcome back to my channel. My name is Erica, and definitely, if you are new here, a very warm welcome from me to you. And of course, if you are returning from my other series, uh, my journey to health, definitely a warm welcome to you as well. Um, I'm really glad you guys are here. I know this is something that I'm totally doing something different today, but I guess just a little bit of backstory. I promise it won't be too long. Essentially, one month ago, one month and two days ago, I had bariatric surgery and I've been trying to basically get my body and my mind and just everything all in check. So I figured maybe I should start some sort of regimen, like workout regimen. I mean, I've never been one to really like work out too much. I mean, I did like sports and stuff in school. Um, every once in a while I would attempt to swim, but maybe I should legit like try some exercises. I mean, considering we're one month out, one month post-op. Also, side note, if you are a retro rockabilly aficionado, please do not hate on me with my bumper bangs. Um, they look kind of crappy um, because I've never done them before. I was trying something new and different. Um, and definitely having a bad hair day, super flat and humid outside and just kind of frizz. Um, but anyways, what I figured we'd do, we could start off this episode by doing an unboxing. Um, I love watching people unbox stuff. It's just kind of my thing. So I figured maybe I can try something, especially since it has to do with my workout regimen. And I'm, I'm saying like a regimen, like as if I have an idea of what I'm doing, but I don't really know what I'm doing. That's normal for me. Welcome to the show. Okay, so... I decided that, I don't know if you remember, um, like two episodes ago, back into my other, ch my other series, I had mentioned that I wanted to possibly get a mini trampoline. Well, I did. Because there was just such fond memories of, from my childhood of jumping on that little mini trampoline. We actually had a real trampoline. I'd like to get one of those. I'm trying to convince my husband to let me get one. Um, <laughs> I do what I want. Yeah, and then it talks about like your insurance goes higher. I don't really know. But definitely, I figured I needed something to help with the ligaments. I don't know if you noticed, right now I'm wearing a regular sports bra and uh, was having issues when I stepped on the mini trampoline. Um, I noticed that my chest was really dropping really hard and it was quite painful. So I decided to look into it to see if there's something with that. So apparently they're called Cooper's ligaments. Um, there are ligaments of bands of tough, fibrous, flexible, connective tissues that shape and support your breasts. They're also known as the suspensory ligaments. And yeah, so basically they help maintain the shape and the structural integrity of your breasts. The problem is, is if you are a big breasted woman, such as myself um you know jumping any sort of like vigorous activity is going to cause these connective tissues to pull and can tear and rip and before you know it you're just sagging down to your waist okay um personally my own personal choice i don't want to have that happen i'm already losing a good amount of weight and i know that skin is going to be an issue um, however, if I can try to help it in the slightest, then I'm going to try because I really don't want to have any more surgery. Just not my thing. My husband thinks I'm beautiful. Um, I think I'm decent looking. Well, uh, <laughs> oh, maybe we should talk about self-esteem. So yeah, Cooper's ligaments, they can cause your breasts to sag and droop and point downward. There are certain things that can cause your breasts to sag, whether it be pregnancies or gaining weight, losing weight, and essentially um, working out and jumping activities like that, you need something to support yourself. Um, so I decided that after I got this mini trampoline that I would get some sports bras to try out. I normally wear something that's a little more supportive, but I wanted something that was gonna keep me in, um, and I decided to try it. Fun fact, they're not that supportive, and still, they were bouncing everywhere. So I began looking online, and of course, this video is not sponsored. I actually bought this on my own, but I decided to order one of those bras from SheFit. 
They looked intense, and honestly, what sold me was their plus size model. She's gorgeous, by the way. Um, you see her, and she's like kickboxing and just punching everywhere, and she looks just so cool. And I was like, dang, she looks like she has big boobs, and those are staying in pretty well. So I decided to get me some. Well, lucky for you, I actually have my package. It's exciting. I'm waiting to do this video just so I can open it with you guys, do an unboxing video for SheFit. Again, this video is not sponsored. SheFit, if you do want to sponsor me, you just, you let me know. I'm, I'm down for the hoedown. Okay, I guess maybe we should open it. But first, there should be some, you know, just, I'm gonna open it. Okay. Okay, all right. So let's see, we got some sort of bag here. Ooh, I like this bag already. Wake up, kick ass, repeat. That's actually pretty cool. Um, this is like a garment bag. I think you can like wash it in there. I think that's what that's for, that's pretty cool. And of course, this bra was not cheap. This bra was $65. Um, but I want to say I had a coupon for like free shipping or something. I don't know. It was on the website. Um, now I got the ultimate black one. This is the most high impact bra that they have. And of course my size is for Lux. I'm really hoping that this is going to fit me. Um, and as I'm losing weight, you know, that's, it's going to get bigger, but okay. What are these papers in here? If you're not happy with your fit, let us help you get it right. Exchanges and returns. Oh, they said first slip into your bra like a t-shirt. The zipper goes into your front, front, put your arms through the holes and over your head. I don't know if that's going to fit. Let's see. Let's, we're, we're going to check it out. Ooh, I like the material. It's quite nice. This is intense. It's like weighty. Um, one of the things that I loved about it that I saw in the video, you see her put it on and then she takes this thing in the back and then she like swooshes it over and it just looks super intense. Like, yeah, I'm making this tight. And then they show you in the front, like how the, the front goes up and tightens. And uh, definitely it's got all these lines for the high impact. It's got this nice banded waist. And then it looks like it's got a, a little flappy do to go over the zipper, I guess, so it doesn't scratch you. That's interesting. Okay. Okay. So do you see that? Do you see the whole, uh, maybe I should get it closer. Okay. So this is what it looks like so far. All right. See the little zippers, things, or zippers, <laughs> Velcro things that you can pull up and tighten. And alongside the back has this like big hearty strap, it says she fit. And then the video they take it and they make it tight. Oh, it's nice. Let's, let's take this bra apart. Let's take a look and see at it. Okay, good deal. The inside has got some nice porous uh, material, I guess, for you to breathe in it. And it's got these little hooks. That's actually pretty damn cool. I wonder if technically you can hook them first and then zip. Because that's what I may have to do. Because I don't foresee me slipping this over my head and ruining my terrible looking hair already. There's no, I don't think I can. No, there's, there's no way. <laughs> yeah, no, that's not gonna happen. Um, I hope this bra fits or else this video is just worthless. Um, maybe I should do this part like really, really loose. Like just a little bit. Let me see if that would fit over my head easier. Yeah, no, that's not working either. Um, let me go see if I can try to get this bra on. I am home alone, other than my son, he's actually taking a nap right now. Um, 
Oh, this is cool. It says, is that a sticker? <gasps> they have a sticker. I was right. I was right. This is a laundry bag. It says, holds two bras. Keep all straps in place before washing. Lay fat, fat. Lay flat, <laughs> lay flat to dry. We don't recommend tumble drying. Do not place near open flame. Use with household washing machines made from recycled material. All right, but it's a sticker. I mean, I don't know where I'm gonna put it on. I feel like you know, like when you're a kid and you get those stickers and you just like paste them on your forehead and or like your favorite notebook. Um, maybe I'll put it on my work computer. Wake up, kick ass, repeat. So this is a garment bag. How nice. Okay, great. Um, I wonder if they include those in every purchase or is it like a new thing? And also, this is like a little boingy thing. I wonder if this is like a hair tie thing. If it is, that'd be cool. I'm always down to do my hair. You know what, guys? This is going to be really fun. Uh, maybe we could do like some sort of like experiment where like I try just this bra jumping. And then I know there's another technique like where you double bra and try to do that. We should totally do that. Let's do that real quick before I try this one on. This is like a little hairband. How fun. I'm going to wear it on my hand. It says, we are sexy, strong, confident. Oh, yeah. Great. We are sexy. Okay. So I have my mini trampoline set up. Um, it did come with some like handlebars, but I feel like my balance isn't that bad. And I think it'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we'll see. And I had to move the trampoline to a different part of the room because there's like a chandelier right there and I don't want to hit it. You know, that would just not be good. Okay, so right now I am wearing just a regular white sports bra um, with some pants. It is kind of see-through or else I would take my shirt off so you could like see it. Maybe I'll do it with the double one so you can see it, but definitely uh, I don't, I don't want anybody seeing my nipples. It is what it is. You understand. Okay. The test. The first test. Okay. Jumping in place, jumping in place. I feel like my boots are going to touch on my chest. I'm not going to notice. It's pretty bad. Isn't this terrible? This is just like a boob jiggling video. It's not the point. It's the point to see that there's no support. Okay, we're gonna do the other, the other theory. Can you take a double bra, put it on, and have more support? Just a sec. Okay, second bra. Um, excuse my bandage. Um, one of my incisions ripped open. It is what it is. Um, but now I have two of the same bras on. Apparently, this is something that people do um, to help push in the ladies. Okay, so I don't know if this is really gonna work, but we're gonna try it. All right, here we go. And that's actually not that bad. And by the way, apparently this is some good cardio. I feel like I'm gonna break this <laughs> trampoline, you know? Um, but I feel like the support's actually a little bit better than what I thought it would be. So I guess if you can't afford one right now, this may be a, I don't know. They're still going down like three inches. Yeah, it's not necessarily good. Woohoo! Okay. And last but not least, let's try the She Fit Bra. Okay, so this is the She Fit Bra. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, I kind of broke into a sweat trying to get into it. I feel like if you're smaller, um, maybe it's just a slip and a pull and you know, or you're supposed to put it on like a t-shirt. I didn't do that. I buckled it around the front because I was really afraid that they weren't going to stay in. But here they are. Um, and I waited to do this test with you guys. Okay. All right. Just like the video. Man, there. They are there. She Fit Bra, it, let me, first impressions. It is very tight. Um, I kind of halfway wonder if the 4X for Lux was my size. Ugh. It definitely straps them down to your chest. I gotta say that. Um, but I guess let's give it the real test. Let's see if it works on the mini trampoline. 
Here goes nothing. about this bra because dang y'all dang I'm a fan she fit that's awesome you want to sponsor my video I'm all about it um but not sponsored right now anyways but you know what honestly even though it's like strapped to your chest like legit I feel like I can do so much more like it's not my chest is not weighing down on me so hard so <sighs> thank you so much she fit um, thank you so much for coming and hanging out with me, doing that unboxing. If you like these type of videos, just let me know. Um, I'm always willing to do some more unboxing videos. What else do you want to see? I'm kind of in love. So let's see how it works when I do my first workout video, which will be coming. Erica tries exercise. Um, now I kind of know what my go-to is, um, and I'll probably be ordering more. Um, so she fit if you want to sponsor my video. You just let me know. If you like this video, definitely go ahead and subscribe, give it a thumbs up, and share it with somebody who may be curious if it works. Um, I'm a big girl and I can say this works. This is fantastic. So um, subscribe to my channel. If you would like more of these videos, let me know. What do you want to see me try? I'm willing to buy anything. I have a shopping problem. There's that. And of course, if you want to own your very own SheFit bra, Go ahead down in the description below. There is a link there. You just go ahead and click that link and order yourself one. I do get credit apparently. They're called crowns. They have a rewards program. Uh, so let me know if you like it. And if you end up getting one from my link, definitely thank you for that. Um, it's going to be amazing. And I want to see your videos and your pictures. So tag me on Instagram, Erica in America. And uh, it'll be awesome. I'm so excited. Okay, thanks. I love you. Bye.